Welcome to the Black Gay History Channel. Please share this video and subscribe to this channel for more captivating content. Spiral is the 2019 horror thriller starring gay Jamaican Canadian actor Jeffrey Bauer Chapman, who plays Malik, a husband and father whose family has just moved into a quaint and reclusive new neighborhood with only straight and white people as his neighbors. The interracial partners are raising a 16-year-old daughter together, and when the new neighbors meet the blended family, they do their best to hide their prejudices and put on a front as a supportive and open-minded community. Throughout the eerie trailer, we realize that 10 years ago, a lesbian couple mysteriously died in the same neighborhood, and when Malik catches his neighbors throwing an oddly ritualistic party next door, Malik no longer feels safe in his new home. I love the eerie vibes of the trailer, and if you're a horror fan, a loving family moving into a new neighborhood that gets haunted by creepy intrusive neighbors is a common horror trope at this point. But this time we're seeing this story told from a gay family's perspective. This particular horror theme in the movie's trailer reminds me of other horror classics like Rosemary's Baby, the Amityville Horrors, and Poltergeist. Though I haven't seen the film yet, I wonder if they are also going to address Malik's character being the only black person in the neighborhood as well. In the trailer, we see the gay F-slur spray-painted on their living room wall, so it's clear homophobia will be an important aspect of the movie. It's cool we're seeing more gay characters and families in horror films, which has always been a genre of film LGBTQ people have flocked to for so many years. In horror films, outsiders and the underdog can find their own power as a hero or a villain, and there are so many metaphors for homoeroticism and secret identities in stories about vampires, werewolves, and witches. Before we had major LGBTQ characters in horror films, like we are finally seeing now, LGBTQ people could see themselves in stories like Carrie, Interview with a Vampire, or the gay classic writer Oscar Wilde's The Picture of Dorian Gray, which told stories of finding power within being an outcast or othered. I've always been a fan of fantasy horror films, and I can't wait to check out this film.